Monticello's preservation began with Uriah Phillips Levy in 1834. He wrote, the homes of great men should be preserved as monuments to their glory. When Uriah Levy bought the place in 1834, a visitor who was here at the time said, all is in dilapidation and ruin. We might not have this place if it wasn't for them. When Uriah died, he wanted to leave it as a gift to the United States government, but they turned it down. Eventually, Uriah's nephew, Jefferson Monroe Levy, bought out the interests of his relatives and acquired Monticello. Uriah Levy and Jefferson Levy owned it from 1834 until 1923, longer than the Jeffersons and the Randolphs own it. Jefferson Monroe Levy actually tried to get things back for the house. A lot of what happens right here today is a testimony to them.